What's to you two fam? It's your girl TK and I'm out here car vlogging as usual. Stop playing. Y'all know my life is hella busy so I kind of make videos on the go. Period. And with that being noted, I want to start off by saying today it is like what? 86 damn degrees in sunny South Florida y'all. It's hella hot out here. Like oh my gosh. I cannot believe I am a Florida resident. Oh, but I don't know if I can really be out here when it's really cold. Hold on, let me cut down my AC because it was just a blasting and I'm sure y'all hearing it in the background. Anyhow, today we're not going to be talking about the sunny South Florida weather, although Donald Trump is a Floridian. Today we're going to be talking Donald Trump and how they are now reconvening to talk about Donald Trump regarding the porn money or the hush money I should say it's called hush money let's use the appropriate terminology y'all and I am just literally here for it my question to you is are you here for this tea like are you here for them reconvening looking at more information trying to figure out if they should hold Donald Trump accountable are you here for it hmm I want to know what you are thinking in the comment section below. I need you to comment, like, subscribe, darling. I need you also to make sure those notifications are on because now they are they are in there, y'all. We are reconvened. Now, y'all keep in mind, I want you guys to keep, uh, keep in mind of something. This weekend, Donald Trump was out here campaigning. He was talking big stuff. He was talking like, you know what? It's already done. They're not doing anything to me. They've already made up their mind. They're not going to come after me. I am Mr. Trump. I am Donald Trump. Put some respect on his name. That is what he has. That's what this man has said thus far. Well, he didn't use those words. But in a nutshell, that's what he's basically saying out here in these streets. You know what I'm saying? Put some respect on my name. I can get away with what I want to. I can get away with X, Y, Z and who's going to do something about it. They're not doing nothing in the 70s, the 80s. Shit, we in what, 2022? This man is still, he has not been held accountable for nothing he has done. And it's 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 just it's just amazing to me. It's um, it's egregious, it's abusive, and it's been tolerated. And I am so fudging sick of it. I'm so fudging sick of him getting in the media and exploiting his power because that's exactly what he's doing in my opinion. You know, you gonna have to let me know what you guys think. Is that just a normal thing? Should we expect him to be, you know, acting like a two-year-old on the on media? Should we be laughing at the fact that he has helped to put young black men in prison? He has said that, you know, minorities, including Hispanics, were not allowed to live in his uh, apartment complexes. He has caused January 6th insurrection. He has caused over 400,000 people's deaths due to his statements that COVID was nothing more than just a cold. And we believed in him. We believed in his word because he was the official, the president of the United States, the 45th president of the United States. Let's please get this information correct. Let's please put some respect or whatever on his name. This man, oh my gosh. I hope they are looking at the facts and the facts alone. Because if you do, you can just walk them down a damn road. You can walk them down the road and you will see Donald Trump should be held liable. He should have been held liable. His, his supporters are going to jail but he is not. I am happy to hear that they have reconvened and they are looking at information regarding Donald Trump. I need to know what you think about this whole situation. Even after the fact that, you know, they were trying to basically start terrorizing the Manhattan DA. Cause that's in, in all aspects, that's what they've been trying to do. They're trying to terrorize that man, Alvin Braggs. They don't want him to do his job. They don't want to hold Donald Trump accountable. Who do we think we are, us peasants, to hold Donald Trump accountable? Who do we think we are? Like, he can get away with whatever he wants to because he's above the law. Well, that's, a, you know what, that's exactly how this man acts. That's how he acts. That's how he talks. That's even how he walks. Hell, he said it last weekend. He dropped the case. He's been saying it. He's been saying it, y'all. And I'm so sick of him saying it. 
Somebody needs to hold this man accountable for everything that he has done because he is egregious. And that's my opinion and I'm sticking to it. And with that being noted, guys, I want you guys to know that I do have a community tab always. Y'all know I be writing on it. I'm documenting. I'm looking. Um, actually, I'm going to be looking at a video too because I think it's a great video that we need to be, you know, reviewing. So I'm going to be reviewing that video with you guys shortly. Um... Also, I want you guys to know I do have Instagram. So if you're ever interested, you can follow me on Instagram as well. Oh my gosh, y'all. I am super sorry if I'm sweaty or look sweaty. It's just hot as fudge out here in Florida. Like, oh, Felicia. Anyhow, peace, love, and happiness, y'all. Y'all stay safe, stay blessed, and remember always, darling, pay attention to these laws, rules, regulations, policies, as well as procedures because you don't know how it might impact you. Bye, guys.